Hey guys, what's going on? This is Hooker back at you with another Madden 22 Ultimate Team video. Today, we're going to be rolling some training variety packs. We got boosted odds on golden tickets with our final golden ticket drop of the year, as well as LTD Joe Montana and packs. So we're going to just jump right into it. If you guys are new to the channel, though, please do consider hitting that sub button. We are on the road to 3,000 subscribers. If we hit 3K before the release date of Madden 23, I'll give away a copy to one of you guys. Also, smash that like button and comment down below. It helps more people see the channel, the channel grow, and helps me able to do more giveaways and get better content out to you guys. So, thank you. And we're going to run right into this. I am starting with pre pretty decent uh, training stack, about 500,000. Not planning on running through all of that. We're just going to see if we can get a couple good pulls. Um, probably roll through about half of that training or so. Is the game plan um, doesn't work, or if we, we get on fire, maybe we'll keep going. But right now, we're getting quite a few uniforms, so don't like that. And also, we're getting to the end of the year here, guys. So I've just I'm always my my mind's always rolling. Um, EA hasn't refreshed any packs in this store, at least that I've noticed in well over a week. When are they just going to give us half price packs? Like, it's about time. Just give us the half priced Ultimate Legend, throw Legends in there, Game Changers, Elite, All Pro Fantasies, whatever they want to do. And just give us, like, Band Appreciation Packs Unlimited, something like that. EA, do better. Hey, I thought we might have had it. We got a full Ultimate Legend, though, 97 overall. Add too tall. And if we're going to pull a too tall, can we not pull that too tall? I mean, that's still 97 overall pull. No one's going to complain about that. And then, and then we get 95 right afterwards. Let's go. Getting on a warm streak. Now give us a golden ticket. And then give us Joe Montana and we'll be very, very happy. Uncommon strat. Could have been worse. It could always have been worse than an uncommon strat. That's still like 10k back. Which still pays for your pack, so it's worth it. But if we would have gotten like an LTD or golden ticket, we're almost at the point of breaking even on how much I would have spent in coins. So that's the crazy thing about like one big pull away from that already. Well, for how much I'm going to be spending on this video, I'm not going to be ripping all that training. So let's see though, let's keep going. I mean, the more players you want to give us, the better EA. Definitely. But big animations are always more fun. Have yet to pull an Ultimate Legend LTD out of Pro Fantasy Pack. Or, well, I haven't pulled out of Pro Fantasy Packs either. But out of Training Variety Packs. Which seem to be some of the only packs I'm ripping now. Is, is I just roll through these. And we've got the strat cards. And I'm not I don't I don't mind the strat cards whatsoever. I really do think that they just it's like the coin quick sells that they gave us last year in training varieties. And every time I open these I feel like I mention that, but that's just how I view it. Because they're not L's. Now that 89 pull right there is an L because he only sells for 500 coins because he's been like price locked just from market manipulation, which stinks. It's like you can't post them for more than that. So that's obviously going to be a, just a quick sell card. And there are a few Ultimate Legend set pieces that are starting to, that's starting to happen too. Which is unfortunate for the people that just rip these and then just sell everything off like I do to try to get your coins back, but at least it's happening at the very end. We had 96 pull there too. That's a nice, that's a nice little pull. That's nice like 50, 60 K back or so. I want to say something like that. And we get, I feel like rare strat cards out of these has gotten so much harder to actually have happen. 88 Pollard. Come on, EA. Golden ticket. 
89. I mean, you could you can try to call your shot, but I'll just yell golden ticket before everyone until I until I pull one. So I think that's exactly. It has happened though, where I said we're gonna get a golden ticket, and then boom. I think it happened with an. I don't think it happened with an LTD this year. I think it might have happened with an LTD last year. It's happened with an LTD at some point in time in my YouTube career. However you want to word that hobby, um, but I don't remember when. It's probably like an LTD training reroll thing from a promo. Could have happened this year actually. So I did a lot of those this year compared to last year. I don't know. Doesn't really matter. So we'll move on from that topic. <laughs> a rare strat card. I was just talking about those. That's 50,000 coins. That's pays for probably like 10 of these packs. If, if you're really picking up training cheap, uh, maybe like nine, nine packs. Training's not like one per right now. It's like what? One and a half per. What's the cheapest training right now? We're taking a timeout. I got it loaded over here. Yeah, it's about one and a half per. So not like super expensive or anything. It's not really hard to pick up lots of training, which is nice. I greatly appreciate the fact that it's not. But I still wish they would have dropped training variety packs earlier. Like do them all year long. Because it's not like people are going to rip 500 of them or whatever at a time because beginning of the year training is super expensive. I think from EA's perspective, that could keep the market higher longer. Not necessarily great for us, but then you get more more outs for trying to pull LTDs. You could like only roll a couple of them and then you got alternate uniforms all year. Like I would have loved to see alternate uniforms come out. I think I've talked about this before too. Like when people are actually playing the game versus now like nobody's playing Madden anymore and the people that are just grinding or doing stuff like this. <laughs> um, like we had some people jump on when Rookie Premieres first dropped, pick everything up, get ready for Madden 23. And then like you saw... Well, at least I saw. I feel like cards were super expensive for a couple days there. You were able to sell everything. People were just buying what they needed for the sets. And then they were moving on with their days, which was cool. But now they're gone. So we're probably going to roll this just until we get 300k training left. And then we'll probably call it quits. Save the rest of this training for another video. Probably what you'll see tomorrow. Do one more shot for Joe Montana. So we get what like four more rolls here. Bengals uniform. Boo. It's not what we wanted to see. Do better than that, EA. Common strat. Alright, we're gonna do like two or three more. So we can end this strong. We had a strong start, and then it really cooled off for us. It's right here. Boom. Golden ticket. So I tried to call my shot one more time, but it did not work out. This right here, final pack of the video. Controllers down. What do we get? Oh, common strat card. Let's go. All right, guys. Well, that's all I got for today. Thanks for checking out my video. I appreciate it. Appreciate all of you guys. I love you all. Stay safe and I will see you real soon.